Hey, what's up guys? It's Muffly here today to show you guys how to level up insanely fast using the Brotherhood of Steel uh, side mission. If you guys haven't seen this before or done this before, this is actually pretty quick. I'd say the statue method is a little bit faster. I'll leave a link at the top of the video right here and down in the description below so you guys can check that out. But if you don't have all the materials and the glitches and uh, all that mumbo jumbo on how to do that glitch, this is just as fast, maybe a little bit slower, but hey, it works. So first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Priden. If you didn't unlock that yet, well, go unlock that, do some of the Brotherhood missions. And then when you get here, we're going to go talk to uh, Dr. Whackjob over here who just is in love with technical documents and whatnot. So first thing we're going to do, we're enter the door on the right hand side when we first spawn in, and then we'll go to the main deck. Alright, so Dr. Whackjob is over here on the right first door. What's his real name? Knight. Ah, okay, you now we know. Okay, so... He's gonna, he offers you a little side mission to get technical documents, who cares about that? We're here to get the job, so we're gonna push the X button or square if you're on the PlayStation, and we're gonna accept that. We're gonna get the little side mission, and uh, we'll go outside. One second, once he's done talking, I'll just show you guys how, uh, what he says. Alright, so we'll go ahead, head back on out here back to the command deck turn around and we'll head outside to the flight deck okay so now we're gonna get a little bit of XP uh, you're gonna need a high caliber round maybe not the 50 caliber but uh, something that's going to do a lot of damage. Um, you're going to want to come and crouch right where I'm sitting, right here next to this barrel. Make sure you're hidden when you do this. You don't want any of the Brotherhood of Steel to obviously see you kill somebody. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to take out this guy right here. Boom. And just like that, stay hidden for a couple seconds, and that'll say return to Proctor uh, Crazy Man. And after we do that, It'll just complete the mission. It won't affect the storyline in any way. It won't affect any rep or anything because Fallout 4 does not have the karma system, unlike Fallout 3. Kind of upset about that. Anyway, different side note. We're here for the glitch. So, we go ahead, talk to her. Dr. Talk, doctor. Talk ah, to the doctor. Back. How did the scribe fare? Finish off the, the quest. Scribe didn't make it. Give me another chance. Tell me so, didn't make it, and he'll say that's fine. Not a big which deal. Was lost, we have a million brotherhood, blah blah blah. I'll just keep on sending people really out there to kill, loss. to get However, killed. These patrols must go on. Rest if you need it, and if you're willing to take And that's it. There's 381 the XP that's free, and just you can just literally keep on accepting this quest over and over and over. Because it is a side mission, and these side mission quests I found that are just unlimited. Minimum ones, uh, railroad ones, brotherhood ones, etc. So, this one is the easiest to do, to rank up as quick as possible. And you just rinse and repeat that whole process, guys. So, there it is on the pit boy Same exact thing. So, anyway guys, I hope you guys liked the video. I hope it helped you out a little bit. If it did, leave a like. If you guys have any questions about this, comment down below. If you guys want to see any gameplay or glitches or anything, let me know. Gladly make a video for you guys. Anyways, I hope to see you next time. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, guys. Muffly signing out.